a child, I often used to go to a wood on the edge of our village. I would stop when I reached the meadow just in front of the first row of trees, crouch down on the damp ground, take off my shoes, sling them behind my back, and begin to run. are based on a legend, a legend which became a myth and which then began to spread around the Chinese region more than 5,000 years ago. Kung Fu, once known as Chuan Fa, is represented by two ideograms which signify respectively strong tiger and working man. Originally, this was clearly a reference to the hard work of the peasant farmer. But nowadays, these expressions, by imparting a sense of dedication, strength and sacrifice, help to emphasize the effort and commitment required when studying this martial art. The human organism is made up of yin and yang aspects, which have to be in equilibrium. This could be a dynamic or unstable form of equilibrium, but it should always be in equilibrium. Let us take body temperature as an example. We both produce and disperse heat, but our body temperature must always remain around 37 degrees. Chan. Please tell Thomas, we have to get up early tomorrow. <sighs> Performing our training outside in the open air is an important way of uniting the energy of the cosmos with our human energy. Today, we will be training at Fort Speroni on the hills above Genoa. There are some open spaces inside the fort that provide excellent places for practicing. Master, what's the most effective sort of style? Walk and concentrate on breathing properly or you'll get tired. What do you mean, breathe properly? How do you do it? It is the most natural thing that you do. Remember that the air you breathe is what gives you life. Control it with your mind. Give it the freedom to act and direct it with your will. Thomas! Thomas! Wake up, we've got to go. having a dream. Master! Sean, I dreamt that some followers of other styles were attacking you. But we won because our Kung Fu is better. There isn't a better form of Kung Fu. What makes it better is the use man makes of it. Thomas, it's not victory or defeat that matters. In your dream, the attackers were making a very bad use of their art, even if they'd been the winners. Why is that? Why? Because... Kung Fu doesn't teach us violence and arrogance. You'll be a real winner when the martial art techniques are like words of love in your heart, when you don't just associate them with fighting. Only then will you be a true follower. Let's go.